Shalom Aleichem, sisters and brothers, how are you doing? Thank God, such a blessing to know that the Creator, the Master of the Universe, lives inside of us, every one of us. We are the Holy Chariot that carry the Creator within. The Godly Soul is treasured inside of us, and we are that vessel to shine the light of Hashem out to the world. The way to do it is simply channeling the truth. Like the verse is saying, Adonai Elohim Emet, God is the God of truth. We are channeling Him while expressing the truth, being honest, being truthful, being loyal, being sincere, saying what you feel, not your angers and your sadness and your bitterness, just being honest and expressing your feelings and your thoughts and your concerns, saying your real thoughts, allowing yourself not to be controlled and abused by your fears and the pressure of society, just simply expressing your heart, being your true self. By being honest in thought, in words, speech, and in actions, we are bringing the light of Hashem to all the levels of life and revealing the light of the Creator in creation. When you're being asked or when you ask someone, when you talk with someone in your thoughts, when you walk, when you talk, when you go and you act and you work and you make your art, you do your things, your errands. If you do things in honesty, it brings the truth into your actions, into your words, into your thoughts. By that you're channeling godliness into those life situations, into those levels of creation. And when you do so, you bring down the light of the Creator. And when the light of the Creator shines, it affects your surroundings in the similar way, in a similar way to the way that it affects you. Means that if you spoke the truth about a certain feeling that you dealt with, you will give the strength to the people that will hear you when you will channel those words with truth to deal on their own with similar situations in the same positive and strong and brave way that you did. If you're going to go and work in a positive way, in a way that you feel complete with yourself and right with what you do, honest about your work and profound, when you're going to do so, the light of godliness that will shine through you while you work with truth will shine to your surroundings for them to be able to be loyal, sincere, truthful, honest, trustworthy, and on and on and on. Everything that we do affects in a way greater way than we can imagine. When Moshe spoke with Hashem from Mount Sinai, when he came down, his face were shining and everyone saw him and they say that man is a man of God. Why? From the level of being a man, he became a man of God. Why? Because people saw the light of his soul. People saw the light of, he, of the godliness that shines within him. So when you channel light, you channel godliness. People attach into a world that is beyond your physicality, your physical being. They become one with the soul that revives you, means they become one with Hashem. When you work on your spirituality, when you shine the light of your soul, you connect the people who are enjoying your light to their source, and they become one with their soul, with Hashem that gives them life from within. You are reminding them of the inner connection of their soul to Hashem. And by doing that, you're doing for them the greatest favor ever can be done for a human being. You're allowing him to access into the ancient archives of his soul, into the ancient memory of his existence. And by that, you're allowing him to become one with his creator and to enjoy eternal life in the day to come. Bless you.
and may we all shine our light with love and truth forever. Amen.